Hello and welcome to Late Night Gaming with Law 9 Entertainment. I'm Mycosa and we are playing another round of Minecraft. We are where we left off. With the goodly laggy petistificates. Still don't know why it's lagging here. I really don't. I did a little testing. It'll, it does it no matter how far or near I set the view rating. They seem to be happy with their new home. Wall, keeping them safe and sound. As happy as they can be, I suppose. And I am certain that nothing except for spiders, which aren't aggressive to testificates, which is what I call the villagers. That's that was their first name, is the thing. So I just I just I still call them that. They all the goodly testificates. Now we're gonna do this case. Now you can't quite see it because my face is blocking it a bit. But we're gonna walk home. Now I, for, cause for now, for now we're done. They are safe and secure. And we have things we wanna do back at our base. Okay, so we wanna go to 50, negative 150. So that means that number should be slowly descending. And that number should be rapidly descending, so we are straight that way. See how that uh see how that's useful there? Yeah. So basically we just go this way, give or take. We should hit home. Plus this lets us see the oh the very beautiful scenery we've got dealing with here. Oh, and get eggs. Yep, look at that scenery. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that just beautiful? There's caves down there. Look at that. Look at that. You can, you can kind of see that in there. It's. Huh. Dang. Ooh. Skeletons and a spawner. You could see it there in the bottom left. I, I, it's not intentional there. I'm not. I do not mean to cheat like that, but. Whoa. Now, I'm not surprised. Uh, when it came to the spawners, I kind of dialed the bar up to 11 on this uh, particular area. Oh goodness. Am I doing this at night? Why not? Why not, he asks. Would you like the answers alphabetically, numerically? Uh... Oh boy. Yep, night's falling, so naturally... This is the time. This is the t Can we, uh... Can we do something to, uh... To, um, you know... Is there a redraw? If I set it back down to 12 for just a moment... <laughs> I can turn off the entity shadows, I guess. It occurs to me I can turn the max frame rate down to 60 frames per second. Let's put it back up to 60. Maybe, maybe that's my problem? I don't know. Ooh. Hey! Oh, it was that close. It was. Home was that close. Home was. D I have been recording this, this right here, this moment, including things I've cut out from the beginning because you didn't need to see me open Minecraft. For at this moment, 4 minutes and 53 seconds. And you're not even seeing all of it. It took me literally over an hour to find that village. I'm not even exaggerating. 
It took me over an hour. Oh, by the way, there is a there is a purpose for this. A purpose so important that I'm actually going to remove that and put it, oh, let's say, you know, that's fine there. This here, if, if a skeleton happens to wander down here, will actually block them from spotting and wanting to kill me. But that doesn't matter. That, the... <laughs> It took me over an hour to, 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 to get there. I I wandered in circles for well over an hour and That's just not fair. That's that's not fair. <laughs> I'm not even exaggerating about the, what, what, what the hole in the last episode the whole, one hour later that wasn't exaggerating I was underestimating it it took me profoundly longer to get there than one hour I'm not even kidding Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to go, this episode and this series will go up as a solid documented evidence that I have absolutely no sense of direction. I have none. I have, I have no sense of direction. I, I could get lost doing absolutely anything. I should never be the navigator for anything in anything ever forever. Just forever. You can go up there, and you can go in there, have some eggs, still have some cooked fish, I can claim my fish, there we go, food, some raw fish, that's fine, have some raw salmon, that is also fine. <laughs> I, I think I left my other foods there, yeah, it's okay. Clearly it's not a far walk. My brain isn't even fathoming this. I'm sorry. I'm just still... I, I knew it wasn't terribly far away, but... But... but This is unfair. This is... This is... This is decidedly and miserably unfair. I... I hate everything. I, I, I hate all of the things. Every of the things, any of the things. If there be things, I hate them. I loathe them. I despise them. I abhor them. I detest them. I d I'm j Just, I'm just gonna call this episode my Cosa Rants or something. I don't I don't know. Make baby Whoa, look at that. Baby chick. Aw gay kill cute. At times like this I'm left aware of exactly how bad my sense of direction can be. Let me let me tell you something. In case it wasn't obvious by now, I have a really 
really bad sense of direction. I can get lost so easily. I mean, that was a problem I had even playing old first-person shooters like a uh, Doom, Hexen, Heretic. I I would get lost so often. Unrelated side note, but you gotta admit, that's pretty cool. A naturally grown, easily ascended, easily located, natural little ladder. That's pretty cool. You gotta admit that. I just wanted to see if I'd left anything, and more importantly, I wanted to see, you know, if this had finished growing, and I'm glad that it did. But, but... Wow. I mean, really. I knew my sense of direction was lousy, but... But... I'm gonna cry. Resetting my spawn back here. <laughs> Screw it. We're mining. Clearly, I'm not fit for anything else. I'm like dark wood, and we're gonna make some freaking pickaxes. We're gonna make four wooden pickaxes. Not more buttons. Cobble. Bam. God damn it. You know, you know it, it's fine. This is fine. I'm okay with this. This is okay. is fine. <sighs> this is why I can't have nice things. It's a nice safe fall, you gotta admit. And that's gonna grow. That's gonna grow. Uh, except that middle. Well, I don't need to worry too much about the light down here anymore. I, it's not like anything's going to spawn. There's nothing. There's no floor. <laughs> I can keep this as dark as I want now. It's It's fine. But, uh, that's just, that's just infuriating. Let's go mine a little. So, he says, figuring, you know, uh, you know for the second half of this here, that we're back home, the incredibly depressingly short distance it took to get here. behind on my today's recording. Uh, the day this is going up, assuming I'm you know, fast enough for editing everything, and I'm hoping I am, uh, is actually the same day I'm recording this, which is uncommon for me. Usually I record a couple episodes in a string. I'm a little behind on things because a good chunk of the time I was going to spend recording yesterday, I end up getting some things ready for some later projects. I'm going to be doing a Let's Play of Factorio. I'm looking forward to it. And it's going to be a little, a little multiplayer one with another of my, uh, one of my guildmates, which I'll tell you, I am looking forward to it. And in the meantime, 
I also participated in a podcast with the Let's Play Sanctuary community. Uh, my first time doing a podcast. I'd like to get one together with the HKW guys as well. And this was good, exp good experience, good practice. And I... I hear lava. We're okay, but I know I just heard lava. I make sure I keep my, uh... Sure, I keep um, a uh, cobble ready to go to block things off. Especially when you're doing it like this, it's the easiest way to handle if uh, if you hit if you do hit lava. Remember, um, MC Gamer would uh, travel would recommend a bucket of caving. a simple water bucket and he wouldn't travel without it. <laughs> Ooh, hey, some redstone. Cool. Uh, a little further. Oh, there is one. Oh, no worries. I am, for the record, still on the original texture pack. Until I figure out how to deal with this whole um, mild bit of lag, I'm kind of feeling I should stick with vanilla graphics for at least a bit. I haven't given up on trying different texture packs, and I am in fact looking forward to doing more with that. Uh, whoop, skeleton. And spider. How interesting. It's to my left. Oh well. But anyway, that was a lot of fun with the community there, and it gave me some good practice, some good ideas. Just see something here. Aha, I knew it. They're usually in groups of four. Just for the record. They're, these things are usually in groups of four minimum, sometimes more, but usually either four or eight. I've, I've seen exceptions, of course, but still. I think I really saw much else in here. A bit of iron. That's odd. Iron's another one of those things that usually is in groups, so it was a little surprising. Yeah, ain't gonna worry about it. Oh, for the pff. now, uh, myself a couple more. Six. Just need one. I have an egg. And there. I now know that one's done. Simple as that. That's my method. I know it's a little wasteful, the redstone, but you know, I can always change it. It's not like they're it's not like they're permanently there. I mean oop. I can get it back. Well, not along down that branch, but now I'm going to try and put a link to that podcast. It's a couple hours long, but it was interesting. It was fun being able to talk with other people, especially other gamers. It's a good thing. And I'm looking forward to doing that with the HKW as well, as well as other projects. But that's why this is all a little late, but also why there's, there's just other things also going. Really? Ooh. All right. There's a lot of things going on, and I, for one, am looking forward to it all. Yeah, I think this is a good place to call things a quick, uh, quits. Uh, hi guys. Uh, okay. Excuse me. Just gonna drop off the mushroom, the eggs, yeah, that too, those. We can gather these eggs. Chicken. Chicken? No chicken. Chicken? Chicken! Chicken! No chicken. Oh, well, at least I got me my carrots. 
Well, a little bit of a shorter one for the exposition, but it's been about 20 minutes of recording time. That, to me, says pretty good time to call it quits. Yeah, let's gather these pumpkins really quick. Yeah, I just want to add something really quick here. There are three things, food-wise, that I genuinely just cannot figure out why they don't add to this game. Let me just see what time it is out here. I tried to use the bed because I thought the sun would be setting. Oh, it's setting. It's I'm just a little early. Yeah, that's alright. Hi, derpy squids. Herpity derp. Indeed. But. Well then. Rude. I guess I'm calling them derpy. Did you just. Whew. Well, anyway. Oh, piggy. Yes, come, come, piggy. I have arboreal swine. You can be my subterranean swine. You can live with me. Yes, come, little pig. But yeah, there are three food things. I just can't figure out why they haven't added Number one, I mentioned they've got that recipe for in the game for pumpkin pie. Would it be that hard to make the same recipe, same effects, change the graphics a little bit and add an apple pie instead of a pumpkin pie? Would, would it be that hard? I don't think it would be. I would like them to make apple pie. I mean, it wouldn't maybe be hard. It, all you'd have to do is basically make a duplicate entity of uh, a pumpkin pie. Change the graphics a little, not even a lot. Baby chick. There we go. Giant head baby chick. And otherwise, keep the recipe exactly the same, except make it an apple instead of a pumpkin. Same idea. You know, carrot cake is my favorite cake. Keep the recipe for the carrot cake for the cake exactly the same. Give it exactly everything else the same. Just make it a carrot instead of sugar. Maybe a carrot instead of an egg. Otherwise, keep it the same. Excuse me a second. And lastly, on the same vein, uh, we have cocoa beans, chocolate cake. Same idea, same graphics, same recipe. Just swap the egg for the cocoa bean. Or the sugar for the cocoa bean. One of the two. And otherwise, just keep absolutely everything the same. It'd be a little bit of variety. And for those saying, oh, that's just adding something that's not needed. Well, there's a lot of the decorative blocks. Well, anyway, we've reset the time. So I'm going to call things out here. Give that like button to boop. And as always, thank you all for watching. Happy souls and great day. Bye bye.